So yes, the subject of this video with Uncle Dean, because he's a great man that has a great opinion and he knows life like I do. Born in the 60s, 70s, you, it, 1966 when we won the World Cup. And Uncle yeah. Dean remembers the world before technology, before social media. We had a conversation, we had a life, didn't we? Yeah, you just used to come uptown, know where people drunk or where they hang out. Or use public phone bolts. And well, the point is, in 20 years time, will there be any shops left open where you can actually buy a record and posters and stuff, or CDs? You know what I mean? We just brought Damien Marley's son, some posters, a record. We just done all of this, yeah? And in 20 years time, will there be a shop left open? What's that mean to the Things world? Like barbers will be in restaurants. Yep. Cinema. Yep. But um, like these small shops ago, I went charity shops like that ago. So everything will be brought on the internet. You won't yeah. be able to actually go to shop and buy items like this. I don't reckon. I don't know. It's a job to say it. Yeah, we do hope that the high street uh, restores itself. We do hope there is lots of shops because you can't beat going out in person, meeting people, getting exercise, getting fit, and going to these lovely shops. But if there is no shops, then what will people have to do? Just go online, won't they? Yeah, but it's not the same, is it? You can't. No, yes, but better go through stuff, find stuff yourself. Yep. The racks and all that. So, me and Uncle Dean, we are hoping that there is shops in 20 years' time. We need to keep shops open. So, maybe the people that set rents and set rates for shops, maybe they can make them all very cheap so we have them forever. Yeah, Uncle Dean? Yeah, yeah. And as... There'll be no concerts still, I should imagine. And look, and as we talk about shops and buildings that we want yeah, to keep, the there is the Odium of Colchester, another great building which is going up for auction. Yeah, see the sign, the Odium. We don't want shops to become like the Odium. So please, keep supporting your local shops and businesses like we do.